Let's talk about dumpster diving. If you ever get a chance, there is a great movie. It's called Hackers. In fact, it's one of my top 10 movies. I know, right? Who would have thunk it? It's a really cool movie because, um, one, it's funny to watch now because it's an older movie and they talk about computer technology that's really old now. But in the movie, they had a great example of dumpster diving. And the reason why they were dumpster diving is that they were going to try to hack into this big mainframe. And by going through dumpsters, they could find usernames, passwords, information to try to bypass security systems. So dumpster diving is when you search through trash looking for information. Now, individual pieces of data on their own might not be that important. But when you put information together, you can create a bigger image, which might actually be something worthwhile. Now, if you ever watch TMZ or you ever watch some of these celebrity gossip shows, Pavarazzi's and all these other people are notorious for dumpster diving. So, for example, let's say that the hot new actress, there were rumors about her being pregnant. Well, one of the great ways to find out is to go through her trash. You go through her trash, if you find a pregnancy test, boom, there you go, you're on the front page. So, dumpster diving is going through dumpsters, it's going through trash, looking for information. So how do you stop it? Shred it. Shred your documents. Those unwanted credit card applications, those are actually liabilities because somebody can fill in the information and apply for a credit card under your name. So you want to shred those unwanted applications. You want to shred bank documents. You want to shred financial information. You want to shred medical information if you're not going to hold on to it. You want to shred, 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 shred anything that you wouldn't give somebody on the side of the road. You also want to use something called a cross-cut shredder. So normally shredders cut the paper this way. A cross-cut shredder also does this and this. So you get little confetti. And that's when you want to make sure that you have it. And you can get different levels of shredder. So depending on how small the confetti is, you can get different versions of that. You can also lock the outside area where the trash is placed. Now this is obviously when it's possible, but you want to restrict access to that. The next video, we're going to talk about shoulder surfing.